Howdy! Today we'll be going over basic mentor navigation for the Aggie Mentoring Network. In this video, we will be covering your homepage, top navigation bar, and left hand navigation bar. So let's get started. When you initially log into the Aggie Mentoring Network platform, the first thing you will see is your homepage. Let's start from the top. At the top, you have your resources. These are here to help you acclimate not only to the platform, but also to becoming a mentor. I would highly encourage you to check these out. By simply clicking on them, it will direct you to the resource itself. Next up on your homepage are your community type posts. These include things like forums or articles your fellow mentors and program administrators post. Join in on the conversation and learn from your peers by clicking on a square, maybe following the topic or even creating a response. The bottommost section of your homepage is your program's activity and your activity. So if you wanted to see when you did a certain action or when one of your fellow mentors did something on the platform, check here. And then to the right, you can directly edit your profile and see what it looks like. And that's your homepage, simple as that. Next up is your top navigation bar, which is this maroon bar at the very top of your browser. Now let's start off from left to right. At the top left corner of your top navigation bar, you will see this hamburger button. This will allow you to toggle on and off your left hand navigation bar. Right next to it will be the program name that you're involved in. If you are a part of multiple programs, you can click on this section and select the program you want to go to and it will direct you there. Moving along to the search bar. This search bar will search for names of people in the program. If you're wondering if a colleague or friend is in the program, you can type in their name and try to search for them. Next are your messages. This will take you to your program inbox where you can respond and send out messages. Next to your messages is your pending requests section. By clicking on it, it will take you to the requests mentees have sent you where you can accept or nicely decline their requests. Next, but not least, where you see your picture or initials, when clicked on, will provide a drop down menu where you can view your profile, edit your profile, contact your program administrator, and sign out. And that's it for the top navigation bar. Next up, we'll cover the left-hand navigation bar. Let's start from the top. The Home tab will bring you to your home page, which we reviewed earlier in this video. The Mentors and Mentees tabs will bring you to a listing page where you can filter and search for people you may know or want to meet that are participating in the program. The Mentoring Community section will bring you to places like forums or articles where you and your peers can create and participate in conversations about mentoring. Events will show you any of the events your program administrator has invited you to. If you have any, make sure you RSVP or respectfully decline. Now moving to the help and support section. Help resources will go to a whole repository of help resources that the platform has for you. The tab labeled contact the administrator will allow you to write a message and send it to your program administrator. The overview tab will bring you to the overview page of the program. So if you want to learn more about what your program is about, click here. And finally, sign out will sign you out of the platform. And there you have it. Now you know the basic navigations to maneuver the Aggie Mentoring Network. For more tutorials, click on the link in the description box below. And thank you for watching.